When it comes to producing your own music, most beginners have no idea where to even start. So what we're gonna do today is I'm gonna show you how simple and how easy it is to actually produce your own instrumentals. And we're gonna do it in less than 10 minutes without needing to know music theory, without having any expensive gear. I'm literally just gonna be using my computer and my headphones. And for the purpose of the video, I will use some speakers even though you don't need it. So without any further ado, let's jump into this video. You're gonna watch exactly how we're gonna be able to cook up a fire instrumental in less than 10 minutes. Let's get it. So the first thing that we have to do is we're gonna open up a new session of Logic and you don't need to have Logic, you could use any DAW that you want, but we're gonna use Logic for the purpose of the video. Now, the other thing is I'm gonna be using a tool called Splice. Now, what's dope about Splice is that you don't need to know music theory to be able to use Splice. All you need is to be able to pay 12 bucks a month. We're gonna rock and roll. So the way that works is you get basically an awesome interface where you can basically find sounds of any key and BPM. So I'm just gonna go ahead and find something random. Uh, faces, abstract, pop, volume two, and let's play it and hear how it sounds. That's dope. Okay, I love that. So A minor, 142 BPM. So what's super great is when you're using Splice, what you can do is you can actually match the key in the BPM. So it says A minor 142, A minor 142. So I'm just gonna hit plus, add both, and I'm gonna just simply drag and drop both of those sounds. I'm gonna go ahead and change the actual BPM here to match, put on a loop, and let's hear how they sound. Awesome. Dope. Next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to just go ahead and find maybe one more sound. There, A minor 142. Here's another, a bass, A minor 142. Almost the entire beat. Sweet. And this is a fucking vibe. What's dope is we can use all these, like, legally. So I'm gonna just start kind of turning down things here and there. Okay, this is called a pad. I'd start labeling things just to keep it organized. Synth chords, and then this is the bass. Start turning things down. Cool. The next super dope part is gonna be the drums. This is gonna be fucking easy. So I'm gonna be using a tool here in my DAW called Ultrabeat. Now, Ultrabeat is really, really simple to use. It's something you can get in Logic, but if we take a look back at the computer screen, what you can do is you can save your own drum packs. And I'll do a separate tutorial about how to do that exactly. But what's really dope is that you can literally take drums from Splice, drag and drop them into this, again, a video for another time, and you can save those sounds for later. So coming back here to my DAW, I have drums from super big time producers such as Murda Beats, Boy Wanda, Wanda Girl, Sunny Digital. So I'm just gonna go ahead and find Future Soul and R&B. Let's see what that one comes out like. Awesome, so we got that. All I'm gonna have to do is hit Command K, drag this over one. Right? I like those snaps. Here we go. Hit record. Three, four, one, two, and so easy, right? Drag that over, hit command D to duplicate. That way we have the same drum pack. <laughs> My windows are shaking. Command D. Find some hi-hats. I'm gonna use this tool called note repeat. So, by the way, how sick is it that I'm using my little keyboard? So when I hit the note repeat, here's what's gonna happen. Usually, when I hit a note on the keyboard, I hit it once and hold it, one noise. But when I hit note repeat and I hold it down, see how I'm not hitting my finger repeatedly? and it's coming up. Really, really simple and easy how to do that here in Logic. All you have to do is go to Logic Pro, key commands, edit. You have to go to here, note, repeat, click it, learn by key position, type whatever you want on the keyboard, and now you've got your keyboard shortcut. So, without further ado, let's do it. 
So I'm literally holding down the one thing and it's making my hi-hat. How dope is this beat, by the way? Awesome, right? So I'm gonna drag this little blue thing over. I'm gonna pick a different hi-hat, Command D to make another track. I'm gonna pan the main hi-hats a little to the left, make rolls right now and pan those to the right. Pull up note repeat. Good, we got some rolls. I love open hats like that. We're almost done. Oh, hey, hey. I love that open hat. Honestly, I'm vibing with this beat. The next thing I'm gonna do is, I mean, that's it. Like, you've got the beat done. What I like to do is kind of quick arrange it. So I'm just gonna give a little intro. And I might start mixing it, like throw a little, little EQ on here. Right, just to clean everything up. Start labeling them. Hi hat. Hi-hat rolls, open hat. Nice. Honestly, this is what usually happens with me. What ends up happening, I get really fucking hyped and I wanna fucking record, and that's what the fuck we're gonna do. It's literally that easy to start producing your own instrumentals. All you need, go get a tool like Splice. You can get all your sounds from there. You can drag and drop. You can even alter some of these sounds as well, but simply put, I now own, think about the power of what's going on here. I own this instrumental. I didn't have to go to the internet to buy it. I can release this song without needing anybody else's help, and this is all me. As a songwriter, I've got the microphone. I can start making a song right now. I could write, record, and mix this entire song now, and we just did that in less than 10 minutes. So you tell me what you would rather do. Would you rather continue to go to the internet, continue to jack beats off YouTube, continue to rely on other people, or would you rather just, like some people say, would you rather just drink the Kool-Aid and fucking buy into the idea that you can do this by yourself? It's up to you. Now, if you want to learn how to fully produce your own music, make the instrumentals, record pro vocals at home, mix and master in just 90 days, just click the description below and go watch the free training where I literally show you how to get that done and how I've gotten it done for over 40 musicians in my Rapid Fire Music Academy. Thanks so much for watching. I'll see you on the next one. Peace.